Welcome back to Welcome season back to two. Season if you can hear the sparklers. Oh, jeez, like this. Oh, it feels like New no, Year's, man. Everyone. Sorry, everybody on audio, but welcome back. We're back. Woo! This echo. We Woo! need to. Oh, goodness. Don't put this on audio. Please don't put this on audio. Hello. Everyone. We're going to light our rug on Welcome fire. Welcome back. Thank goodness mine's out, bro. Ah, did you guys never go like do fireworks at places? No, I stop. I've never done it in my life. This is freaking terrible. And then it's um tradition to eat the stick. Who's tradition? It's hot though. Let me. Uh, mm? No, lads. <laughs> I love how in our heads it was like this is gonna go so well. They were all trying to dodge fire. <laughs> I like it. We started off well. That is so dangerous. Alrighty. Like, Good afternoon or afternoon. evening, depending on what type of um, country Time's you're watching in. in. Hey, shout out the Germans. <laughs> they watch us. What? Never forget. What? <laughs> Who the fuck is this guy? But yes, uh, baby, welcome back to season two of Bob's podcast. Sorry for that chaotic start. That was freaking bad. But we're here. We're back. Davey, well going. How's it, buddy? How you doing? Hey, bro, I've been fine. I can't lie. I can't lie. You know, it didn't, didn't so good that you didn't want to come back. We it's had so to good that no drag you. Yeah, me specifically. I was like, guys, I really think that I've outgrown this podcast. And you were like... Libs, you're still five foot four. And I said, wait a minute. <laughs> not, not six foot. Not I'm five, not, not five, three. Not five, eleven. Not five, three. You know, you're rude. You're five, three. What anyway, is five, three? For those of you who don't know us, my name is Captain Libresil. To the left of me, we have... Sound boy, because I'm checking my audio now. Cause Ooh. Is it good? Uh, apparently, it's great. <laughs> well, then, if you can hear me loud and clear, it is your boy... Davido. Yes, boy. Echo good. And Fuck behind you, the man. camera as always. Oh, guys. I hate Libs What even Mike. happened, eh? <laughs> We had such a solid my thing operation. Is... <laughs> oh, my. <laughs> yes, boy. <laughs> <laughs> Which part? For those of you who don't know who I am or who the beautiful man to the left of me is, I am your Vobs master captain. Lebrazil to the left of me, we got Davido. Yes, boy, Vows Master Davido. And behind the camera, as always, crawling underneath the table to do what? I don't know, but it's your certified Vows controller. Hi. DJ D. Yo, 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 what's up? Season two, let's do this. Yes, boy, Dol, you've been away for a long time, bro. How are you doing? I'm good, man. I feel like we've taken a long, rested, well, good <sighs> break. And I feel like. When we come uh, <laughs> but we here. Oh, this guy always goes on forever, man. <laughs> what? Oh, I just want to talk about how he is. The people don't come for that, though. They come here for... I don't know why they actually come back. If you're here and you missed us, shout out to you. Beautiful time. Oh. Dustino. How you doing, buddy? Hey, bro, I'm good. How was your break? It was good. Uh, we, I mean, we saw each other often. Too often, We some didn't take say. a break, yeah, we... <laughs> yeah, we're, for everybody, maybe we should take a break. For everybody doesn't know, we're not just work colleagues, we're actual friends. <laughs> and Davey and I have seen each other. I don't think a single week has gone by without me seeing you at least three times. That's horrible. Surely. Thank oh God, those shirts off already. It's hot in here. It's not that hot. It's huh? getting hot in here. So take off all your clothes. You know the fans want to see it, Davey. Get shirtless for the fans. Now nah, my nips, my season We've two been getting a lot of is resurrection. My season two resurrection is to I said resurrection. bring back Buffermet. <laughs> what? <laughs> it's, 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 you wouldn't get it. It's fine. <laughs> is it an anime reference? No. D&D, actually. I oh, see, that's the yeah. thing. Uh, New resolution f- is no nips. You won't catch any of these bad boys. Uh, oh my life. Please, can we just skip to the part where his nips come out? <laughs> <laughs> They're going to come out. Yeah, fully. Oh, goodness. But Dustino, new year, new us, new studio. Yeah. You fucking promised the people. And, and we with, delivered Bill's house. Yeah, no stress whatsoever. You, you guys thought that we were getting an actual... No. <laughs> We're just, we're just going to move around <laughs> houses now. <laughs> Your house might be next. 
Comment which house we should go to next. And <laughs> Comment we- your address, <laughs> and we'll be there within the hour. <laughs> <laughs> Probably without you knowing. <laughs> oh my goodness. Don't call the cops. It's just us. <laughs> it's just fire <violent> fair. <laughs> <laughs> oh, that's beautiful. That's a new segment. <laughs> How long can we stay in your house before you call the cops? Oh goodness. Hey guys, we're on a half 42. <laughs> really hoping that they find us at this point. <laughs> my parents miss me quite a lot. <laughs> oh my days. Mm. Man, I've missed this. Yeah. Shit. Yeah. I just to say. Just that so felt so forced. No, I'm no, no. <laughs> Don't stick to the script. <laughs> <laughs> I know you like to be jazzy every now and then. I know you like to so. throw your input in. Listen, doll, you're here for one thing, and that's to stitch me and Dave up. <laughs> Don't act like you enjoy being Don't here. Act all friendly and <laughs> like happy you care to be about us. <laughs> How's this guy? <laughs> no, it's all love, bro. It's all love. Yeah, 100%, bro. We haven't done this in a minute. It does feel a bit, like, weird to come back and mm. do it again. Like, I don't know. It feels weird. I must admit, the weird thing for me is the new studio. I feel like I'm literally scraping my chin on the mic. Yeah, even work. me. I feel like I'm being blocked off by this thing, and I don't even know, man. Yeah, but it is. Yeah. We still have lights. The beautiful lights. Oh, goodness. Look, they're we're green. Changed, what segment was green again? Remember, for the OG viewers, remember when segments had colors? <laughs> For the OG viewers, remember when we had promises and structure? <laughs> For the OG viewers, remember when you enjoyed being here? <laughs> remember when we enjoyed being here? <laughs> oh, God. Shout out episode one. <laughs> shout, out the, <laughs> shout out the thought mind map we had. We brainstorm well. We're a freaking solid unit. You guys probably would have seen all the promo we did for this episode. It was great. That was cool. We yeah. come up with very cool ideas. It's just the implementation part is so difficult. That's what I was saying, yeah, dude. But if we have meetings, we need action points. Yeah. Otherwise, we won't do shit. Legit. Oh, goodness. It's terrible. But yeah, 2022, the year of pr- kept promises. Promise them something right now, though. Promise the viewers. Yeah, let's get married. I'm down. <laughs> I'm back. <laughs> and I'm sluttier than ever. Sarah, I'm, I'm sorry. sorry. <laughs> Sarah, please. <laughs> Sarah Connor. Someone was telling me that we should do like a thing where it's like a competition almost and you win a Valentine's Day date with Dave. Oh, <laughs> and I didn't want to say it because I was like, I don't know what that's all about. But now I'm like, I think that would be That'd the be most exciting. perfect thing. That'd be dope. And then, the whole thing for the like, yeah, win a fucking guys. You call it? We so for everyone Fan day. we did we did promotion, not a promotion. We filmed the skit that we did now, and I realize now I'm terrible at acting. You're the best actor. I hate it. Don't run that San Lamia clip of Davey pretending he's lost in the woods. (laughs) (laughs) But if you guys actually want to see me then on a date, it would be disgusting. It's not like I'm at a date. This damn mic, I'm just scraping my chin. Um, It's in front of me. Fuck you. Yeah, sorry. I'm aggressive. It's just, I, I wouldn't be able to be like, people watching me be on a date it's oh it's but no, it's not like we're watching you we're here but for the shot like we will keep quiet as possible until <laughs> like you say literally anything <laughs> yeah. Wait, why do i feel like you guys would be like next to i thought yeah, you guys no, would be recording same yeah same yeah. table exactly right <laughs> we're gonna mic you up and everything no i'll be there with the boom <laughs> how's it how's it how's it, how's it? Sorry, i don't want to get this in your pasta <laughs> i don't want to dip my stick in your pasta <laughs> Dave, say that same thing again but with more emotion <laughs> um can we just I'm cut sorry can for cheating sarah <laughs> <laughs> and he was telling the viewers that he doesn't <laughs> <laughs> oh gosh oh yeah also we have a filter on instagram now so Yay. yeah if you guys saw that we dropped the reel as well go try it out see what your vibe is i would like to personally apologize that they are all rude as fuck <laughs> i just for me the that one that says dave or bash i've gotten about three people that have messaged me really? now <laughs> <laughs> saying bit yeah. <laughs> and it's like i mean i probably would 
Sorry, I'm being I'm being disgusting. This <laughs> the episode. way that I'm literally witnessing this for the like in front of you and Dill's busy looking away and I'm like, please look at him. Please can someone get this man in order? We're trying to we're trying to run a successful podcast and he's trying to get his dogs out. <laughs> but yeah, that one that one we should have not run. The day would bash. Just no, I'll it's up to you. Know. Did it did it open any opportunities? Definitely no. Oh. Which, no. Well then Excuse it's Todd and Talon. I love those boys, uh, but and Megan, Megan messaged me. Ooh. Shout out, Megan. Woo! Who else? I don't know. Who else would Dave bash? <laughs> Let's just—that's the episode. We're gonna list Dave's top five people at this moment in time. Who he would bash? Who's Groot? <laughs> you fuck, baby Groot. No, big Groot. <laughs> <laughs> wait, wait. You fucking Groot is Groot. Gonna get those vines all up in <laughs> you. Groot's gonna get those roots, baby. <laughs> <laughs> you know what I, I don't want to be. You know what I love when Dylan laughs like that? But he's like, because hmm. he doesn't care. He's like, yeah, let's get to the good part. Can yeah. we skip to the good part? <laughs> oh, gosh. Davey, I'm almost hesitant to ask. But new season, you know, new us. Yeah, new us. New potential. Ooh. For new vibes. Vob checks, that is. Oh, shit. Would you like to get into this week's Vob checks, which we're probably going to abolish after this episode? Last ever Vob check. I, I often think of you as very charismatic. I'm listening attentively. And what was that? <laughs> you do so well. Indeed. No, no, it's not me. I, <laughs> you, you, did you know? <laughs> Men said, come back for season three, please. <laughs> <laughs> it might be a season three. <laughs> what I meant was, what is... I'm what I'm was... I'm <laughs> I'm I'm I might walk off the set. I might walk did you off do, the did set. Did you do vibe checks? Yeah, obviously. But oh. apparently we're done with vibe checks. Sorry, all of you who loved them so much. <laughs> but dictator Dick Dave over here <laughs> has decided not only are vibe checks done for, but so is my self-esteem. <laughs> so when I start whispering, you'll know exactly who fucking did it. it Turn it to red, bro. What what fucking Mustafa right now, me and you, bro? You got the high ground because I'm dying out here. <laughs> Oh fuck! No, we don't have to. I wanted to. I no, like, I, like like you. <laughs> I don't want to do it anymore. I hate vibe checks. Mm. Are you gonna apologize so we can continue? <laughs> no, I'm not touching you. I need an apology. I'm sorry. Yeah, it's okay. I'm My really man sorry. said, "What was that?" <laughs> do you know how disrespectful that is? Do you know, I think I'm projecting because of that skit that we did. I feel very tense. Well, so now you're like everybody else is just equally as shit as yeah. I am. Yeah, yeah, I hate it. That was ridiculous, bro. T- tell them what we did because David's not a David's not a good actor. Yeah, explain to them why you hate no, acting. No, actually, actually, that was bullshit. David is a good actor. He just can't was... follow instructions. He's been trying to he's been <laughs> pretend to be my friend for years. Oh fuck my leg! <laughs> what? I got pins and needles. <laughs> you, you're a good actor. You just get nervous at anything i i realize i am a very nervous person like nervous i get anxiety movie. and about when you everything. get nervous you lash out ah. Ah, ah. Well, that's why i'm no longer charismatic yeah, <laughs> yeah. <laughs> <laughs> bro I'm so, I'm so done i'm doing the best i can i'm running on red bull coffee and fucking straight russian beer and uh, <laughs> And now this guy's out trying to tell me lives. I wish that you didn't lift as much as you did yesterday because your energy is low and your charisma is dead. You bitch. You did well there yesterday. No, I did. Did. Lippo still hasn't told me. Did you win? You... Has he not told... I haven't told him anything because I want to film a video oh, about yes, it. Yeah. yeah, I want to record yeah, so. this thing. Well, oh, this is all good. Uh, like, lifting competition. How's it? I went, did my first not powerlifting a, meet yesterday. Also, not a lifting competition. It was how things like oh, it it's, was a bi- the yeah, it's like yeah. a big thing. Yeah, it's yeah. a big thing, man. It's pretty big. It's oh, scary. Our, our little boy 
He's grown into a beautiful man. Look at my shirt. It says Gauteng's. Oh, fuck. Why didn't I get one of those? Yeah, they were there where you were buying your fucking thing, Bro, letting a hundred people come before you in the line. Bro, uh, <laughs> the East. Once again, I love it. I wish I didn't do this myself. But the East just brings it into me. The East has no form of lines of ordinance or anything <laughs> like that. I'm literally standing in the line and people are just walking in front of me. <laughs> like, <laughs> like, what the fuck is this? That's annoying, man. And I was and like, everyone else is doing it. And then like, I knew some people from SA. Not SA, ew. The ad. No, Joburg. <laughs> I mean, poor ways. Jeez, like, I forgot where what I was. The fuck? Like, they were like, oh, don't try. You go in front of me. And uh, I was like, there's only nice people in the East, the people from Four Ways. I'm going to get so much hate for this. <laughs> no, the, the East Run Club back, just stop going there. <laughs> I, I always end up people. going back. So, did you go what lives, eh? Yeah, yeah. So, you ended up going. Yeah, yeah. that was love, and man. I can't lie. Was there like, oh, did you enjoy this port? I mean, yeah, I did 100%. Like, the fact that, like, I had Davey there to, like, banter with between. Because it's not hectic. Like, you don't have to stay at the back the entire time. Like, when they were having changeovers, like breaks, I'd go chill and I'd talk to Davey about like what just happened. Yeah, because you and said then, you only lifted like nine times, right? Yeah, everyone only lifts nine times. It's three attempts of each lift. So you have your squat, your bench, your deadlift. And then you start with squats and then you get three attempts to do obviously the most that you can, then bench and then dead. If you want to know about my performance, let me plug my shit. Go follow me, Captain Le Brazil, on Instagram and YouTube because I want to make a video about it. Because like, I don't know. I just want to have it for me. Not even for anyone else at this point, just for me. Mm. Just so that it's like, oh yeah, this is a recap of what happened. Also, a lot of people are asking me like, oh, how did it go? And I kind of just want to make one thing to be like, that's how it went. Yeah, yeah, that makes sense. Because like to explain the same thing a bunch of times. Because I, I can tell you this much, yeah. It's I was rigged. I enjoyed it. <laughs> a racist. No. <laughs> hey, no, 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 no. You can believe that for the <laughs> Patreon. <laughs> Please don't. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> I was being dramatic. Uh, no. I, I, I was mad. Uh, you were very mad for me, and that made me feel, you know, good that I had niggas in my corner. But it was a thing of like, I wasn't, I was obviously like, I think I was disappointed <laughs> with myself for not qualifying for essays. Mm. But at the same time, it was like, it's your first comp. Yeah, for me, it's, I, I, like, my whole entire thing was like, watching it yesterday, I was like, for the first comp, that was super solid. Just because, mm-hmm. it's, like, you know, obviously I think in the video he'll explain it more but it's like there's a lot of rules and things on how you do it so you can completely get that lift yeah, yeah. but it's like if the, if you go too fast or something they'll just cancel you they're like no sorry you don't get the lift oh, yeah. Serious? yeah so mm. that, that for me is a, one of your yeah that's three wild. wait how many did I four no you cancelled because it was it was the first was squat then bench, it was bench yeah it was two on bench but I didn't get that the third squat because you went yeah, too that fast was, so the uh, first squat, I didn't make depth. Uh, okay. So like you meant to squat to a certain depth, I didn't get depth. So even though the front judge was like, it's a solid squat, the two on the side were like, nah, it wasn't. I, you know, with anything, it's like, you want to be like, I feel like I got down like low enough. And like, but I don't want to get into politics of powerlifting because yeah. I want to, you know, come back and do it again. But you know, I trust the judges. I trust the process. And it's like. Yeah, yeah you know what that reminds me of? Do you remember uh, World's Strongest Man with Thor? Yeah. I don't know if you guys ever saw that Pulled thing. Mm-hmm. When he was also like for the past like six competitions or whatever, there was one judge that they brought on that actually like uh, was paying attention to the rules like properly. Mm-hmm. And he was tuning Thor and was like, nah, like half your fucking reps on this specific exercise you didn't do to depth or whatever. Oh, hectic. And you didn't do them properly, so they don't count. Yeah. And then everyone was like uproaring. And then they went to go watch videos of all the past and he never does it properly. Oh, really? And hectic. he gets so pissed off. And that, there was a huge thing with him and Eddie Hall and stuff. Yeah. It's wild because I feel like it happens a lot in comps. Mm, even CrossFit as well. CrossFit, you have your judge right next to you, which is annoying. So they'll, because you have to do 100 reps, they'll be telling you like, oh, no rep. So then you have to be like, oh shit, like I thought, now, now I was, I thought I was on 59, 49. It's like, no rest, still 49. And it's like, this is annoying. Hectic and they're like screaming in your ear probably. Yeah, no must, yeah no they're like, no rest, no rest. No and it must be frustrating as prick, dude. Yeah, yeah. dude, shit. Yeah. For me, it's like, at the end of the day, it's annoying as well, but I guess it's there, like, you need, you need those rules there. Like, for me, my big thing is like, it's... Just let like a small thing slide, and it's like once you let the small thing slide, then yeah. it's so yeah. it's anarchy basically. Yeah. So there's only one clear solution, and that's that I just got to get stronger. 
Not only that, just better instructions, apparently. <laughs> get a better and following instructions, yeah. Like, I, I won't spoil too much for it, but literally for, like, his bench, like, the video I got, it's it's, it's a bench. There's the bench. And then, like, I wish you could see my reaction because I'm recording like a proud father. <laughs> and then it's like, no lift. And I'm like, what? <laughs> <laughs> what the fuck? Yeah. <laughs> Dude, just zoom in on his face. <laughs> <laughs> I'm sorry, I didn't want to tweet about this. <laughs> the Federation <laughs> hates. <laughs> <laughs> and you, Philip, what I was about to say. <laughs> oh, yeah. They yeah, are very fun, very well organized event. Shout out mm, to fun. you know Powerlifting SA and Barbell 1610. Well. Shout out Barbell 1610. Mm. That man was sick. I had to apologize for swearing yesterday as well. Where? There, I swore after not making a lift. Oh, like loud? And no, not even super loud. I just swore to myself. Uh, but you're not allowed to swear. Apparently, like at like nationals and stuff you can get disqualified for swearing. Oh, hate. Yeah, like completely taken out of the competition. So I literally was just like, yeah, yeah. Uh, apologies. They didn't tell about this one, did they? No, there was no stream. I think it's just because of how things like you'd rather watch like SAs being streamed and shit like that. Will they stream SAs? Yeah, hundred percent. But not to TV. To no TV. YouTube. Uh, yeah. That's dope, man. Yeah, but I feel like the sport is coming up. I heard something like apparently there were like hundred and forty people in like twenty nineteen or tw- or last year or something, and now there were like hundred and eighty people who entered in the entire event. So it's like powerlifting is coming up. I feel like people will taking it more seriously looking That's at it cool. deeply yeah the, so Thomas me say the the competition would happen throughout the province yeah the, so the country mm, so and eastern capes one is next week and then all of them are going to come it all happens in potch so like everybody comes up to potch and then worlds this year is in sun city so we might go see rossi if you guys are fucking, Sun C- yeah you want to see Russell win his fucking third time? Would you have been able to make if you qualify essays and one essays in that time frame and then qualify for You all. don't even have to win essays. You just have to make a total. So powerlifting's uh, total day. So it's like hmm. if I make the total to qualify for essays and then I make the total to qualify for Worlds, then yeah, I can go to Worlds if the SA team is like, yeah, that guy, so he's strong. So can I make the title of this video, Lebs nearly made Worlds? Cause I didn't though. But I mean, you could have. I, d- I didn't. But you nearly could. Did. I, I didn't. You nearly so the did. thing is, you could have competed. In the, in the grand scheme of things, in comparison to me and Dill, you're the closest to Worlds <laughs> right now. <laughs> <laughs> that's, yeah. Yeah, but that's because I'm fucking affiliated. Oh, oh don't, I'll is. talk to you about this. Here's the, the boy with the affiliation. Oh, excuse me. Um, <laughs> Sorry, I'm <Okay>. unaffiliated. <laughs> I, don't, I didn't sign to a record Affiliations. Label. I haven't people. sold out like lips. <laughs> yeah. But that was fun. That was enjoyable. I feel like I'd want to do more of those things. You know what I mean? Like more comps and stuff. You recently started a new sport. Hey? Big dust over there. Huh? Murder. <laughs> That's elite hunting. That's right, <laughs> ladies and gents. I'm purging. Davy kills people. <laughs> oh, please believe that. What are you doing? Uh, I broke the sparkler. I've got like I do things with my hands. I broke all these the sparklers. Sparkler. Actually, annoying me. Like they're gross to look at. Yeah. Do you want to light up some more sparklers, David? I'm You're like a season one. We only yeah. we did not need any sparklers. I don't actually want to light more. Thank that was God. dangerous. But you started a new sport. Mm, I started disc golf. I I wish it was cooler <laughs> than it's. I I fucking love it. You know. Oh, I was waiting for a big like wind up. I thought you set him up and he was just <laughs> no, like just gone. No, I was being honest. He just started his board. No, no, I just thought like no. Sorry, when I say wind up, I thought you were like like getting him ready to have this big reveal of the sport, and then he's just no, like no. Because do you know? Because yeah, how do you say disc golf in a way that doesn't sound like no? Like, I went to frisbee. <laughs> <laughs> That's two different sports. Oh, okay, you, tell us about you, it. Piece of cock, <laughs> bro. <laughs> no, but even then, I went and I was telling someone at work. I was like. She's like, oh, Dad, what are you doing on Saturday? And I was like, I'm, I'm going to go play disc golf. And she was like, what, like, throw a frisbee? <laughs> <laughs> and I, I like, and the only thing is, it's like, you have to get so technical to just sound, like, desperate. And it's like, no, I mean, like, there's different, like, discs and everything, like, hot, bigger discs. <laughs> it's like, but you're, but you're throwing a frisbee <laughs> at, the end of the day, you're at, a, just at a hole. And it's like, no, it's not a hole. It's like a bucket with it's got chains, chains. <laughs> and she's like and she's like okay and then she just got up and like walked away and i was like Fuck. <laughs> how do i make this yeah. sound like a legitimate sport but it's so much fun <laughs> like for anyone who i i wouldn't i don't know like 
what the soul searching is because it's like if anyone looking to relax go do it no if you want to get angry <laughs> go do that because my i i'm i'm no stranger to throwing a frisbee or That's throwing a tantrum <laughs> And Tantrum. shit, when those things, two things combine. Yeah. <laughs> I think, yeah, um, for me, my big thing was just, it gets lost. And you're just there, like, walking through the felt in Kailami, and you're just like, how is that? Do you like, not just look. I like, wish it was that easy. Weird. I wish it was that easy. Uh. But then, the nice thing is, so I, I played, I think, twice now. Yeah, twice. And the first time, I at least went to the group of guys, and, like, that, that, you should see, like, they're thrown, it's like, uh, just landed there, like, they know exactly where to look, and, like, they got all the things, mm. everyone's so nice, it's a nice community, easy, I feel like things that are niche like that always have, like, nice communities mm. behind them, like, going to, like, a CrossFit gym, powerlifting gym, fucking disc golf center, I don't know, yeah. what I think it's because, like, it's something that's so unique, that's being followed by, like, even a little yeah. bit of people, then everyone's like, oh, that's so dope that you actually enjoy something I enjoy, and then it's, like, very, uh, natural but no, i'm trying to look for a word like i don't know it's like to find somebody that likes something you like you always get excited yeah, it's like when you're exactly a kid and then you're like oh did that. you see that new show and then you're like Yu-Gi-Oh! and then you're like yeah <laughs> it's like, oh, yeah and then you get to talk about it because like it's exciting yeah, but yeah exactly now for me it's like it's really nice and i'm i'm excited to get good i just hurt my wrists um on the tuesday fapping we should we should vlog actually we should go play uh, around and vlog it and then Post it on Patreon. That'd I be sick. Like Patreon vlogs. Patreon Bob's vlogs. vlogs. Only on Patreon. We can leak them on YouTube as well. Yeah, even why not? I'm, no, because I use copyrighted music and I'm not trying to <laughs> <laughs> get the channel banned. Even after Bob's, actually. Nah. Let's not say too... I don't know. I feel like we can tell people about shit that we want to do, but not right now. Because we'll I'm trying to... We'll tell them the stories because one of my New Year's resurrections, according to Lebs, is also yep. to post more stories and vibes. So hopefully you'll see a lot more of my face. Oh, show them your phone. Oh, Davey. Oh. Sellout. <laughs> Davey's a fucking sellout, dude. This guy used to ride for Andrew. I know. I don't know why everyone always thinks that. He used to be no, such an Andrew. No, no, you were, bro. No, I used, no. For me, it's like... I will, I never once said anything bad about Apple. I would be like, if I have an Android, I'm happy with it. Like, I never once said Apple was cut. You know, no. you know what David was? It wasn't even Android. It was just, it was against the grain with phones, always. And he was always like, I'm not getting a Samsung or yeah, what? This nigga had a Lenovo I, phone. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> my, my, my biggest regret in life was H- getting, getting, yeah, getting that, that, so for in matric we were like the test group for what is now the main book system in school where we had the tablets and everything everyone was getting their ipads and their samsungs and i was like i want a powerful machine <laughs> i want something that i could hack with or something like that i i'm a douchebag is what genuinely what i am a full douche and then i was like let me get like this what was it, an asus and it w- was oh, running an asus yeah i was I running one yeah right yeah no what did you say an asus no, I thought you. I thought it was a Microsoft, like pure Microsoft brand. No, no, I thought it was Microsoft. no. I don't have money for like the Surface or anything, but yeah, it was literally it was an Asus and it was hell. Uh. It was so much hell. I had to go to like separate classes to get my books because no one knew how to work them. Oh, yeah, I never connected to anything. Everyone was playing sick games. He was in the library every two seconds, bro, at that support desk. Like, um, I can't. And they're like, why did you get science? this thing? <laughs> Oh, it was cuck. Yeah. And that, that's, where, that's what I regret. But, I mean, I drove broke my Android when I had it. That, that was fun. That was sick, yeah. You're always doing the most in fucking high school, huh? Full douchebag. Yeah. <laughs> but I was sick, man. Yeah, you were sick, bro. Remember your crossbow? Anyway, <laughs> let's move on before he throws a tantrum about what happened to his crossbow <laughs> never skype lebs for cool things exactly you why am i having deja vu why do i feel like we've talked about this before like you constantly say on the podcast complain orange have we ever had orange i just keep it up because it's nice for uh, advertise and calm down the viewers but it's nice for reals because then it keeps it different keeps it exciting yeah it makes it look like it was set on two different days that's not true we're still in the same clothes. And Dills in no clothes. Where did your pants go? I have pants on. <laughs> That's a nice cocky you got there. <laughs> is, that, is that a dolphin tattoo? <laughs> Stop looking at it. <laughs> Bill Shaver and the chicken. 
Does he actually have a chicken tattoo? No, yeah, he's got a chicken. A rooster that he used to Oh have. yeah, he's got that birthmark. Yeah. Looks like a rooster. Rooster shy shush. Oh, I can I can check the beats now these days, eh? No. <laughs> no. <laughs> Leave it alone. Five check. Let's get back into that. What's yours? Fuck. <laughs> I can do the ones that I prep, but I don't want to after you discouraged me. Oh no, leaves come here. Why would I do that? Why would I do that? Dude, stop, stop. Some of my arms are so big, man. Because the shirt is a medium, bro. I can't wear anything that's not a large anymore. I hate it. Imagine that, dude. I'm like, yo, let me get a medium because everybody here is bigger than me. So medium will most likely be like a solid fit you know what i mean it like, fits nicely it fits too tightly i always hate wearing shirts that are this tight dude like honestly if it cups my breastuses like this if no need i remember the one time i think it was grade 11 it was for greg and i's party and then i wore like a toy shirt like a was it that like, red one with the pocket yeah yeah it's yeah it's either that the same same shirt but it was white, white. oh it, i remember uh, that that thing was like I was, was in early 2000s. I was going clubbing like it's, it's <laughs> V-neck vibes. Yeah. Man's in Miami yeah. cheating on his girlfriend. Jeez, that was a Jersey Shore that, reference. That, I didn't think you actually would do that. That was that was a peak time was in a our life. That was a cold life, night. Oh my god, man! It were always such cold nights. But did I ever tell you I was in bed, yeah, with someone, and then they had gotten up, yeah, and then gotten out of the bed while we were sleeping, and then I thought that it was so that Todd could come and sleep next to me. So the whole night, yeah, <laughs> I'm busy pushing him and, like, kicking it because I'm, like, annoyed. I'm, like, what the fuck? Like, oh, I was literally in the bed, like, having, like, a chilled sleep. And now suddenly this fucking asshole's next to me, yeah. Turns out, like, go to bed finally, wake up in the morning, look next to me, it's Dylan. <laughs> and I was, like, oh, no shame. Because <laughs> I remember you were sleeping on the floor in that room. And then he had come because I thought like they'd gone Todd had come from his other room to oh, come sleep that in that. Later. Yeah. Yeah, that. Yeah. Yeah, after the party. Yeah, I don't remember you kicking me and stuff, but I remember the next morning yeah. you telling me and I was like, oh, I was out. <laughs> I was dead, dude. I didn't feel anything. <laughs> yeah, I was so mad, but I don't even know why. Like I was just oh, like yeah. annoyed. You guys, you guys were... It was love, man. I, no, kind. no, I remember what you guys were doing. And all of us, we we slept like eight people in in our friend Greg's bed, which was a double bed at the time. And oh yeah, that was a weird situation. These two, we were just sleeping, bro. Mm-hmm. We were just sleeping. I'm uh, so confused as to what you're going on about. Right? Yeah, sure. No, I'm actually genuinely interested. What are we doing? Yeah, you, you guys were chasing tail. We went, yeah. Uh, yeah. yeah. Because I didn't want to cuddle with 10 men in a bed. Right, he's fucking boring, dude, this guy, thinking Check that, your... oh, these guys are trying to do... No. There was a perfectly good... You are literally floor. on the floor, dude. Yeah. But you... with com- good company. Yeah, it was good company. It was good chats. Tail chases. Anyway, I won't... You know, I didn't even know you were chasing tail that night. Yeah, and it worked. Yeah, it did, but it, it was just confusing to me. Like, when the aforementioned person got out of the bed and then went to the floor. I didn't know you were trying... So, I'm like, oh, I shouldn't have been in this room. <laughs> <laughs> like, I should have booked... Like, I know I booked a bed and I was like, I'm sleeping here. But with you, I didn't know you were trying. So, I was just like, okay. Who did you sleep next to? We can't... Oh, must I just... You're going to blow out? Yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah it was... <laughs> <laughs> New <laughs> season <laughs> say. Oh. You, oh, no, dumbass. This fucking. He's not gonna block it. Up. Not the night. No, he has to because that's <laughs> we're not those guys. But that was right. It was the first night that. I swear it wasn't. Like I feel like night. I knew them, man. Why would she have been there? If oh, it I wasn't know. like it. It was very much like new though. I remember because I I met them that night. Yeah, but you, you never wanted to talk to any of them. Yeah. yeah, this guy sucks, man. That's why you didn't get invited to the next party. <laughs> Even though it was your birthday. <laughs> oh, so <sore> subject. <laughs> Sour one. Wait, did it, was it actually a party? <laughs> no, you were there. <laughs> I was like, oh, yeah. <laughs> Even that morning was so weird. Waking up and everybody was in. 
Was that the same one where everybody was in the other side? Yo, there were a lot of people at that party, hey? Yeah, there was a lot of people that slept there. When yeah. you deep it, how big is that entire, like, house? Yeah. It's For there to have been that many people on one side, that many people on the other, and then we were still catching up. How vibes. many people yeah. in total, do you think? I remember 38. I counted For the party or sleeping? For the party. Oh, uh, no, there were more than 38. There were at least 50 that time. No way. Mm. Well, yeah, it, it was 11 and 12, yeah? Mm. Which one was bigger? 11. Definitely 11. Oh, 11, yeah. 11 was bigger. No, 12, we didn't do anything. 12, we did. No, 12, we did, though. Oh, it was at Greg's 21st, we didn't do anything. Yeah. Oh, yeah. The reason I know is because it was also my birthday, but no one remembers that. And it's, I'm not sour about it. I'm not sour. Was that Greg's 21st? <laughs> no, no, no. No, no. no, no. no. I was... No, because my 21st, we actually did something and then Greg yeah. didn't want to do anything. For people who don't, who are lost, Davey's birthday is four days, no, three days before Greg's birthday. And they'd have joint parties when they became friends. But people would always be like, Greg's party, Greg's party. And Dave's like, it's my party too. <laughs> it's my party too. I invited them. I invited them. It's my party. It's my friends. <laughs> oh, but let's, let's be honest. We know me and birthdays just don't mesh well. Like I don't plan anything. So maybe Do I didn't even get that. <laughs> That's me, bro. I literally. You know Could have stopped there, buddy. <laughs> <laughs> and they don't though. That's why they didn't know it was my birthday. <laughs> That's so tough. But yeah, dude, I feel the exact same way with you, like on birthdays, bro. Yeah. Birthdays are bum to plan for. Yeah, especially for yourself. Dude, because even now you come, you come off hella, what's the word? Vain or narcissistic, I guess. Yeah, yeah. Have a good time for yourself. It's weird, eh? Mm. Right. Because even me, like, I was talking to Dave about it the other day. Like, I'm I'm contemplating, do I do something for my birthday next week or do I scrap it? You know what I mean? Because I have no idea if I actually want to organize something. But I also want to have a thing with a lot of people that I yeah, know. I don't I know. I feel you, dude. You know what's cuck? Sorry, Dave. You no know what's cuck? Yeah. is like, I experience it so much is having, trying to organize something and then you don't enjoy yourself anyways because you yeah. organize something for yourself and then there's too many people and then you're hosting. Yeah, yeah. It's so shit. I wish it was like, you just need a designated person that takes on. Yeah, like every birthday. birthday. That's exactly, yeah. That's, you, you need it. Yeah. I, I think there should literally be like a thing that you can say in a friend group because it sounds very, as well, narcissistic. Like, I don't want to plan anything for my birthday. Can you do it? So that's yeah. what, what I did last yeah. year. And thank goodness, like, Lebs is Lebs. I was like, I kind of want a th- surprise part. Oh, I wanted to reply, but I don't want to plan anything. And then it's like, surprise party is the best thing to do yeah. there. Because it's like, relatively, you don't have to be involved at all. Yeah. And, and I think you're more bound to have a good time as well, because then you're not expecting it relatively. Yeah. So I think there should be a, a new social norm where you can literally say to your friend, please plan something yeah. for me. Like, it's, yeah. and it sounds hectic, but it's like, it's so much no, easier. No, I'd prefer that. would be such a better oh. gift than any fucking material. Dude, yeah. literally any material thing. Like, just, because Dave looked at me the other day and he's like, because I didn't know how to word it. And he's like, you want to do something, you just don't want to plan it. And I'm like, yes. And he's like, don't worry, Lebs, we're doing nothing for your birthday. <laughs> <laughs> just we're not going to do the entire anything. day open. I promise we won't do anything. <laughs> <laughs> Loud and, and clear. You and know, we'd all said all at home. <laughs> you don't know what scares me is that. Is that like I've left it. Like I haven't done anything yet. And I'm all like, I wonder if Dave's going <laughs> to. Christian, when do people stop planning surprise parties? <laughs> Day off? Day off? No? <laughs> Dave's trying to plan if he can stop doing something. Yeah. yeah. No. You don't have to. You don't. My birthday's on a Wednesday. So. No. Hey, Wednesday jewels, bro. They go hard. I'm not doing anything on a Wednesday. I've trained. Well, yeah, you're not. <laughs> <laughs> no one is. <laughs> oh, good. <laughs> Thank you, Dil. Oh, gosh. Golly, gosh. Excuse. <laughs> I'm heavy footed. Someone said that I was heavy handed the other day. I said. <laughs> I think it was me. You called me heavy handed? Yeah. I've never struck you. <laughs> 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 oh gosh but yeah bro do you want Dave at this point of the episode I don't know whether or not to ask if you even want the vibe checks I want them you want them I want them. are you sure how long have we been filming for bro we'll hey for good before. 40 minutes man how did you get the recordings again oh buddy I'm fast I'm like flash 
No one even sees me running past these cameras. <laughs> oh, Blade! Because I'm black. <laughs> yes, everyone, Dullah's doing blackface behind the camera. <laughs> <laughs> the story of a didn't know none. Blade's my favorite Marvel character. And what's Blade's power? <laughs> Tax evasion. There we go. <laughs> All right. <laughs> I thought Tom was going to be like, Black, black power? Black, <laughs> black power? <laughs> Thanks, Lips. I'm going to say that in my slam poetry night. <laughs> black power? My Blades. <laughs> milk during <laughs> that was a funny scene. Oh god. But yeah, vibe checks. <gasps> Let's fucking do it. Why not? Huh? For the last time, ladies and gents. No. We're throwing it away. We're doing them every every s- We'll never get rid of vibe checks because literally no one's asked us to get rid of it. That's my thing. We've only heard great things about vibe checks. They love the People stop me on the streets. And they say, so please put, please put on, on your, your pants. pants. <laughs> <laughs> no way. <laughs> and then? Uh, we back, what? baby. Uh, mm-hmm. And then they say, great vibe checks. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> okay. My boy, the cocky. <laughs> <laughs> so the. <laughs> Why do I feel like there's some dude in cocky pants? <laughs> what? The cocky. The cocky. <laughs> uh, so, first vibe check, season two. Feel like it should be, you know, solid one because we have two weeks to find David a date for. Da 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 da. Vibe check on Valentine's Day. My favorite thing about Valentine's Day is that my mom always gets me a Valentine's Day gift. No Aww. one else gets me gifts. Is that a thing that parents do? It's just my mom. Yeah, it's stuff. just you, dude. Oh, that's so weird. weird. Yeah. There was this oh, one she's who was like, my, oh, my forever Valentine or something, and it's her dad. Like, her dad always gets her shit. I don't know who it was, so I might be bad. I remember out when someone I was gonna like, text young. Me. <laughs> and I, real- I, like, I realized how unwanted that was. Play the sad music. I'm just gonna switch to a bit of a raid. I don't want to do this. Like, and, oh, chicken meat. Oh, Valentine's Day. Um, yeah, I remember like when I was like in grade eight and like towards my prime years of what pizza face they used to call me. And then pizza I'm sorry, what pizza face? Yeah, yeah, people used to call me pizza face. Pizza face? Yeah, I remember that, the that acne. Oh, sh- that's hate. Kids are rude, man. Yeah, kids are vile. But yeah, I remember my stem used to get spit yeah. fun. Yeah, I think it was you actually. <laughs> <laughs> I didn't even know you, just came to school. Pizza face. <laughs> 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 <You're alone. laughs> Someone you know I'm insecure. Red's <laughs> 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 uh, uh, the color of pizza. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Carry on. Uh, I get hungry just thinking about it. Yo, let's get pizza. Oh, you're getting like enchiladas or something. Let's get pizza. Mm. I'm not being fed by anyone tonight. <laughs> Sorry, Dave, continue, man. I apologize. So, my, yeah, my, my, pizza my parents. Shout out, pizza boy. That boy, your skin look a pretty oily. <laughs> uh, More like I, pizza. Oh, I'm not going to be rude. I mean, that was rude. Cry. <laughs> yeah. no, tell us, tell us. no, I'm confident now. Um, yeah, my parents just give me like Valentine's Day things. I think like this boy is not getting anything. Like, we have to help him out yeah. at least. So. I've never gotten anything for Valentine's Day. Mm-mm. I don't think I've ever oh, been in I a remember, relationship. I can't remember who it was. Someone in like grade 11 got me. Yeah? A Valentine's Day thing. And I was just like, it was a friend thing. And I was just, yeah, when just, you were in grade 11? Yeah, yeah. You got it. I can't remember. Yeah, that's horrible because you say they're your no, friend. No, I, I, okay, I know who it is. Who I was it? I don't want to say. No, because I know, you may not no, know. No, man, who. no. He's, far, he's good these days, bro. Do you see, you. He sees no. value, bro. He sees value in bleeping things out now, so he does it. Okay, let's let's time it. Say it and I'll... Let's play 30 seconds. Woman? Yes. Opposite. Man? Bad? Oh, hectic. No. Yeah. Wait, what? Yeah, go fuck yourself. Go bleep the out. I know him. He won't bleep it out. Thanks. Yeah. yeah. That wasn't a friend thing. 
knowing who it is, yeah, you're blind. You're blind. No, that was were, not a free. No, that was not a free thing. Give five other people. Yeah, I feel like to make it like a chillers thing. How are you saying that you lums the minute ago? You still don't know. You just want to be a part of it. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Oh, I hate you. <laughs> no, he's fine. Anyway. Yeah, yeah. I don't think that was a friend thing at all. Grade 11. No, did you did alum- she get you something? No, it's just like a card. Uh, it was like my first, my first card I got. And I was like, wow, yeah. this is fucking sweet. No, that wasn't a friend I, thing. I think I've given out like a, a lot of Valentine's Day gifts. Really? It's I, weird. I've only ever been on like one Valentine's Day date. Horrible. You remember <laughs> that one? Horrible. Was I part of it? No. Oh. <laughs> no, the guy was matric. Why would I remember it? Oh, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> my, <from> my, secrecy. <laughs> my boy Lebs needs a break for Valentine's Day. I need Day. a break. I'm tired. No? Who? What? Last name? Uh, forgot. <laughs> What's his last name? No, I shouldn't be going to the bird park with his. Oh, wait, no, the, her name's not Aid. That was an actual date, not a Valentine's Day date. Uh-huh. And that ended in flames. Of, Yo! <laughs> <laughs> could you explain? Yeah, could you explain? Could you explain your Valentine's Day hey, you favorite? Don't do what? Bird Park is your car tire, you ass. <laughs> <laughs> you this guy. Have you been me for so long? You've literally taken every glass of the bird park. Yeah, so? <laughs> so for everyone, everyone confused. It's a solid fucking Dill, place. Dill, when he was single. Used to have a specific place he would take everyone into. It's like his. I hate you. What what's the opposite of kryptonite? Like makes you stronger, kind of thing. Uh, it was the sun. It, what's not an Achilles heel? Yeah, like <laughs> the sun. Yeah. Dull, it, Dull used to like he take it and he would always like do his best work yeah. at this place, Kaitai, which is now. I've actually saw Kaitai the other day. I mean, if you've ever yeah, seen nice. Dylan <laughs> doing a major production show. You could cut out all the lights in the show and greet Dylan. But God forbid you went up and greeted him while he's imagining me work at Kratai. <sighs> Stir fry. Stir fry. No thanks, uh, baby. Yeah, bro. <laughs> My man at Kratai. Big work. Big and then worker. lives at the bird park in Monty. <laughs> no, not a treat. What would you do? What what is it that gets this? this song is You're apparent. just going around looking at birds. It really doesn't do much. Like there's a cool show where the owl goes and it hits on. I mean, yeah, lands I mean, on someone's hand. I mean, Dill's in a relationship and you're not. Yeah. I guess the bird park's not too good. <laughs> <laughs> you should have taken him to cut time. Like. <laughs> this this single top of GGO's ass <laughs> fuck to my left. Who wants to talk to me? <laughs> <laughs> what I'm single. You guys suck, Everybody man. has a place, bro. Comment your place down below on my life. Where is Everybody Top- has Topo's a place. Topos is your place, dude. Name one girl you've lumps that you haven't seen in Topos. Oh, yeah. yeah, this guy is clapped, bro. I can't believe you. Topos is the one that made, he feels like, oh yeah, I'm I have depth. <laughs> I'm cool. I'm taking you to that. Topo no, I, I don't do it then. I don't do it then. It's usually Yeah, I don't do oh, yeah, whatever. One lives. <laughs> Step is one is topos. Yeah, it's not like I'm making out in a bird park. The fuck? Did the flamingos looking at me like, dude? <laughs> dude. <laughs> dude. <laughs> dude. <laughs> yeah. oh, good. For audio, I had my hand up like a flamingo. <laughs> and for audio, I had my leg up like an actual flamingo. And for audio, we're sorry. <laughs> and for audio, this has been video <laughs> podcast. <laughs> for audio. <laughs> for audio. <laughs> All right, okay. <laughs> for the uh, yeah. I'm checking Valentine's Day. <laughs> <laughs> Terrible. <laughs> Welcome back to season 10. <laughs> Full circle, baby. <laughs> Valentine's Day is shit vibes. I'm not going to lie yeah. to you. It's a, it's a thing created by the government to get you to spend more money. Easy, easy, easy way. And yeah. What? <laughs> <laughs> what? <laughs> I don't know. Oh, God. Uh,
fucking hate it here. <laughs> mm. But yeah, created by the government. Are you, do you have any plans for this Valentine's Day? Are you going to try organize something for Valentine's Day? I'm open. I'm not doing anything. <laughs> <laughs> what about you? We actually... Sarah. Should, um, mm-hmm. <laughs> yeah? No, we were actually going to plan on doing something like really cool because I haven't done... I've, I've never done like Valentine's Day shit. I'd always How long have you been dating Papa? Yeah. Sorry? Four years. We we break up on Valentine's Day and get back together <laughs> after. <laughs> <laughs> Your girls don't do anything. Bill plans this fight so well. He, on the 13th, he's just like, Papa, I don't like when you do this. <laughs> do what? I'll, just, I'll, I'll take a break quickly for the recording. <laughs> I'm keeping this. <laughs> <laughs> he wants to stitch. No, I'm saying like on the 13th, you like start a fight. And it's like, Papa, I don't like when you do this. And she, then they get into a fight. And then he's like, well, I'm not going to give you a present now because we're fighting. Yeah, 100%. <laughs> and then the 15th. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> I'm going to keep my present. And you would have loved it. Santa keeps saying to me how excited she is for my birthday. And only last night I clocked. I was like, why? You're just excited to give me my gift. And she's like, yeah. And then I'm like, she got your gift already. She's got my gift already. I know you, man. I should probably start planning your birthday as well. Because <laughs> that's the only gift I know to get you, Lives. Lives, I'm going to be honest with you. I'm listening attentively. Don't turn your birthday like a bit later. No, because the week after I'm in Cape Town. No, I'm just saying like your actual birth. Like, couldn't you have prolonged that? Could it, what, what could I have done mm. in the war? Introspect. To become a what opposite <laughs> of premature. Ah, uh, post mature. Post Malone, <laughs> baby. <laughs> what? What does it mean, dead? <laughs> what? Post mortem is like an no, old Post Malone. <laughs> I was like, Post Malone's not dead. I was like, did you want to do an autopsy <laughs> on me? What? Happy birthday! <laughs> Cause of death, day from the future, <laughs> came back in time and helped me <laughs> to stay in a little longer so he didn't have to plan my party. Just never put my hands where they were there. <laughs> <laughs> anyway, Valentine's Day. Bad vibes. Bad vibes. Bad vibes. Never do Valentine's Day. No. Oh, wait, no. I wanted to ask... No, not you. You said you'd never done anything for Valentine's Day. What the? F- how? Like genuine, without jokes. <laughs> how? Yeah, that's, that's my thought. That's how. Yeah. Mean. I've done stuff. Yeah. <laughs> this is like when you ask a dude, oh, "Have you ever done weed?" And like, I've done stuff. Yeah. I smoked a firework once <laughs> with my dad. He was watching. He's cool. <laughs> it honks. <laughs> <laughs> Oh gosh. I would draw that. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> uh, it's a good yeah. video. Do you want to hear the next vibe check? Yes. How long are we going for today? Ah, fuck it, dude. Let's just vibe, eh? Ooh. Uh, one second. No, I can't. I'm trying to yeah, vibe. Trying sensor. to make them both the same color. Like right. For all the audio listeners, <laughs> for audio, <laughs> <laughs> anyway, they've changed the color to orange. Next vibe check, and it's one that I came up with in December but never got the chance to ask you. Yeah, uh-huh. pots and pans, isn't it? The ick, Ooh. Ooh. I, 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 I'm glad you brought this up. I'm not, I'm, it's a good subject. Thank you. What's the ick, Libs? The ick is when a male or girl or I, anyone. Anyone. Realistically, anyone. Any any person. Yeah, well. everyone. When they do something that immediately makes you like, from that moment, you're just no longer attracted to them. Like whatever vibes you had before no. just disappear. Like this it's usually like happens on like first or second dates. First or second dates. It's just a switch. Like they'll say something like, raw can't believe you got that vaccine and you're like <laughs> what <laughs> or like they'll say some shit like i wish oh. that was the and then you're sorry you're getting the wrong time 
This guy, this guy, this guy, this guy, this guy wants to make everything about him, and I love it. Please continue, Dave. No, no, Please continue. It, I beg you, continue. It is good vibes because it re- it shows you that you don't want to fight. <laughs> you don't. Because of the right person, you ignore the ick, and I think that's what love is. But there's no ick if there's a right person. No, you ignore the ick. That's what love is. No, I feel like I feel like we should shut to- up. <laughs> 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 Dave, just for balance, what gives you the ick? Like, what's something that gives Jens ick? Even you can answer, Mister. Shut up. <laughs> um, <laughs> <laughs> he's really. Uh, so the ick, it can. But what gives you the ick? Like, name an example of something that gave you the ick. Something or someone. <laughs> something. Like something that, what what are we? <laughs> Five years old. <laughs> I'm sorry. Okay, go. Um, I I can't think now. Uh, there's no one thing that's given. Yeah, you it's like in in occasionally the one time I feel like I don't know. It's not obvious, but it's fine. Dad. You know, a lot of us haven't been on enough dates or with a lot of people so it's it's completely natural what you you know you don't have the words because you've never experienced it and that's fine dude if i was immature on between if i was immature could be cut with the line version. that's nice pizza <laughs> boy <laughs> oh no. <laughs> no, no, no no i'm sniffing it we're stopping this <laughs> no more toxicity <laughs> um, nothing but love yeah like the have you ever had when someone like says like so um but like often where it's just, like it becomes like a characteristic of them, like so um yeah um, some um, and then when no, it's annoying when you um, notice um, it um, <laughs> um, <laughs> um, and, um, <laughs> <laughs> I hate that as well yeah when you clock someone's like mannerism mm. or like something that they do and you like realize they do it a lot yeah. it's like for simple reference it's like when someone says like a bunch yeah and you clock it you're like because for me, I think it was like a few years back, it was the so, um, and like, and one. Uh, and it was like, y- you're there. Like, huh. <laughs> <laughs> what, are you, what are you talking about? That's great. That's great. I was like, in first year, I was like, is this what dates are like? <laughs> yeah. For me, it's bad breath. Ooh. Bad breath gave me the ick so quick. Ooh. Put that in the fucking t-shirt. But yeah, I was dead ass like, ugh. That's my, that's my biggest fear, hey? I've realized. That you have bad breath. Yeah. Bro, my mom trained me, bro. Whenever I go on a date, I literally will stop at a garage and buy gum and be chewing it on the way there. Like, obviously, you brush your teeth and all that, but you just have that fear of, like, uh, what if today is the day? Yeah. I'm just yeah. a bit of food stuck in me. Oh, I feel like, you know what, actually, bad breath for me at work, dude, is the worst because I know I've got it after coffee. Oh, really? Oh, you know, oh, oh, I never actually think about coffee, bro. Oh, coffee, bro. As soon as you have your first sip, there's done. You know what's what been jarring me? What? One of the worst experiences of my life was in grade six. Uh, my my six. English teacher, she smoked and dude, drank coffee. Dude, teachers double. need to stop that. Yeah. They, and they she, quiet and, like, and they drink hey, coffee. Hey, what's the problem? And then like, they talk I'm to stupid, you. Dude, but imagine me, I'm trying to get my marks on. back. Ugh. That's horrible. Disgusting. Fucking disgusting. Fix yourself. The worst was as well booze. Some teachers, I don't want to say names, but man would be speaking to you in your that's face. My, that's my biggest. And small, well, like. That and hygiene, man. Like that. Like, hygiene. Because as well, it's like, for me, my biggest fear is after like a night out, and especially at work and like hairdressing, you're close to the person. It's like, could you smell the alcohol? Yeah. Just like evaporating off. No, but I'll be honest with you. Lately, I've been talking to a lot of people who just breathe booze at me. And I'm like, like, I have no problem with drinking, people getting drunk, whatever. Like, I'm a chill oak. But you're, when you're your talking thunder, to a man. drunk person and they, they're huffing in your face, you know? They're like, ah. <laughs> that thing has been getting me riled up lately. Wow. So, <laughs> now, you guys that relatively don't yeah, speak. Yeah. yeah, pizza boy. What's the egg for you, though? What get, yeah, what gets your egg going? They Oof. show interest back. <laughs> <laughs> when I actually stop chasing, stop <laughs> don't understand. <laughs> no, no, no. Do you know they stop playing hard to get? <laughs> I love playing on hard. Uh, no, no, no. 
I really can't even identify like the first thing. I don't. Even, I don't think I've ever had it. Do you, do, do gents get the egg? Mm. Yeah. Mm. I feel like it, it's naive to classify it to a gender. Because mm. I feel like the fact that you can't think of a lot of things. Yeah, right but now. my thing is, it's like red flags. I mean, you can go back to the episode where it's like identify red flags, and for me, I was still thinking it's like you know, for like in. in but I feel place. like I feel like there's a difference between a red flag and an ick. Like you can ignore a red flag, but an yes. ick changes how you see that person yeah. entirely. <laughs> like yeah. I remember, I got the ick recently. Let me not say recently, because then people will be like, "Who have you been linking, Libs?" And then they'll let me lie. <laughs> no, but I got the the ick, and I. It sounds like the most childish thing, but it was, I think it was just because, and this is, this is a very toxic thing, but you know, when you're talking to somebody and they're, they're giving you the same energy back and for some reason you switch off. They're too interested. Yeah. Too interested is the you thing. Guys are, you guys it's are horrible. It's I us. hate it. No, I, I don't think for me that's Nick, but it's as well. No, actually you're the exact same. And I only mean to, it's like you say you enjoy the chase and things like that. And for you, that ick is them, you're not chasing because it's very much mutual. And there's nothing there. Nothing yeah, and it's good there. when it becomes mutual to a point, but when it's like full throttle, then it's... See, but uh, you, my brain's going wild here, but I feel like that, that specific thing is so... Like, uh, if you don't like the person, then you don't see like a huge future with them or like they're everything. Uh, I feel like... Uh, oh, look at uh, Then if they right. give all that back and you, then you're like, oh, yo, that was boring. Now I'm bored. Yeah. You know, but then if it was actually someone that you're like, yo. Yeah. And they're you giving do. you, of course you're going to be like, shit. Yeah, wow. Fuck this guy. This guy is a rat, dude. <laughs> he literally is like, sorry that you guys haven't found happiness. Um, He's in, in season two. Okay. I'm giving you good advice and we're not going to have this pity oh, party really? anymore. Find love. Yeah. That was very good. No, but that's I yeah, that was very good. Like, it's literally that whole thing of like, it's only creepy if they're not into it type thing. Dominant yeah. doppel. No. Doppel I, me. I thought of my ick, ick. So mine was, imagine I went black after black. I said I remembered. I literally as well. I was like, that's... <laughs> So, uh, we don't have to imagine, dude. That's pretty convincing. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> that, was, that face paint's pretty I hectic. Said, uh, now I have to put subtitles. You forgot your thing, your ick. Yeah, I forgot now, man. Um, Maybe you don't have one. Maybe a solid ick. I think he had his ick, and then he was like, someone could hear this. Let me pretend. And then they'd know that it was them. Did you just rip your no. hair? What? Are you okay? I'm grand. I just hate it. Bill looks like he's oh, about to throw up. I remember, I, I went on a date once, right? With someone. Did he pull out his hair? He, d- he literally pulled out his hair like he's stressed for an exam. <laughs> Did it come out and everything? I <laughs> heard it. It's up. I want to give you a hug. <laughs> Fuck. Okay, this, yeah. Bill, you went on a date. We'll, we'll deal date. with this mess a bit later. <laughs> I don't even think it was a date. You know, when someone was vibing with me, we were at a restaurant and shit, and then she was like, just, you know, when someone's like extremely <sighs> rude. Mm, oh. Ooh. Yeah, dude. And I was that like, can I was be. vibing with her hard, but then you're, oh. when the waiter comes, and then like. That one switches me off, hey? You will brush straight. Yo, when someone's rude to a waiter, or just like the energy you can see is like. Poor. You are lucky Smith. to. Serve, service industry deserves so much more love. Yeah, man. but less love than you give For anyone who doesn't it. give service the appreciation. David tips deserve. 100% every time. You guys need to be stopped because oh, we need to do that. Yeah, let's end it on this. Treat your, wait, your waitress, waitress, waitress. Anyone in the service industry, treat, treat them with respect. That's very true. That's yeah, just, just treat them with respect, bro. Don't be a bro. dick, man. Yeah. Be kind. You never know what people are going through. 2022. Keep vibing and keep kind. And on that note, lips. Dave. As we talk about helicopters landing and things like that. Where can the people find us? You know, lips. I think we should be mature for season two. So exactly. what I'm going to start saying is. Tell them. Often it points with fireplace. You know, in Harry Potter, when Ask about when, what's the way uh, Sirius Black was talking to Harry through the fire? 
if you go to a fireplace and like that, you talk to a fireplace often because you can hear about podcasts. If you too, you've ever played the game Warzone and you get on the on the mongoose or the rider thingy and then it starts playing What's Poppin' by Jack Harlow. If you listen very closely to the sound of the RPG coming for your head, it's actually Vibes Podcast. You know, often at times, uh, if you open up your fridge, you know when you're hungry? Yeah. You open up your fridge and you're like, I've been Shit, hungry. I'm really hungry. And then you close it. When you come back the second time and you're expecting a different result, Vibes Podcast. And that's all, there's, that's all the citation you need. Mm. Um, but also, if you're a real human being, you can also find us on uh, Apple Podcasts, Spotify, App, Amazon Music Podcasts. Which somebody actually found us on there. Why? Like, <laughs> like, please message us. Why do you have that? Is it like, is it, I don't know. Is it a cheaper thing? Is it the only place you can find them? Maybe it's Americans. I think. Because they watch Americans. us. Shout out America. Shout out Netherlands. Shout out the UK. Shout out fucking Germany again. Shout out the River Styx. <laughs> <laughs> he keeps on t- <laughs> I don't know what the river sticks was up until about like last year. Well, they took yeah, a picture. Yeah, those years. Yeah, yeah. 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 Did know. you still have that shirt? Yeah, yeah. Oh, nice, nice. Yeah, nice. I was gonna make it into a vest, but I couldn't. <laughs> this is too blunt. Oh, fair. Make sure that you also go check out our Patreon because we're dropping blogs on there as well. You know, Valve's blogs. Finally, I got a new laptop. It's there. And this Ooh. is this is the sent. Oh, sorry. I was gonna get real sentimental. So if you wanna quickly plug. No, I was going to say, uh, let me mention it earlier, but we have an effect on Instagram and it is really freaking cool. Yeah, find out what effect. your vibe is. That's what I was going to say at the start Use of it. it. Use it and tag us, please. Yeah, and tag maybe it. some cash prizes. Ooh, that's that was a lie. manifest thing. Um, and also, make sure that you go and listen to our Spotify playlist, Vibes FM. Vibes FM. It does bang a bit. I can't lie, we've spent a lot of time on it because we're, we're scared. But you might not like it. But it's good music. It's music that Davey and I always vibe out to. So, you know, we you hope you enjoy it. can imagine that we're there with you. And also, if you guys want to invite us out to your parties. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know. It felt like the right thing to say. Now looking back, <laughs> introspecting, I was like, why did I say that? I love how you, thank you yeah. so much guys for all the support you've been giving us through instagram and everything we know that we took the break and we hopefully this season's going to be the best one yet it will actually be fuck what you thought there we don't know we know <laughs> facts season two best season of vows podcast to date check out for reels on yes. instagram tiktok we're also there often just look out of those window just watch it we're standing there because guess what? We're still in your house. I was 72, baby. <laughs> Thank you so much for joining us on the first episode of season two. And as always, we know we changed you. I what, just wanted to say. Do, 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 do. What's the set? What is the, what is the other one? <laughs> oh, yeah. I'll just. Yeah. I don't know. Okay. And as, as always, always, keep up it. Do it for the vibes. Do it for the vibes. I don't know why you did that. Well, oh. that was.